Banana dumplings, easy, fluffy, and quick to make. I'll start our recipe by removing the peel from two bananas. Guys, I'm sure that after you learn this recipe you will not want to eat bananas any other way. Then with the help of a knife, we will cut our bananas. To facilitate first, I will cut them in half, and then into very small pieces. This way, I'm doing it. Next, we will add two eggs to a bowl. Salt to taste, and also 100 grams of sugar. Then we will mix all the ingredients. Tell me how you like to use bananas in your recipes, I'd love to know. Now let's sit 250 grams of wheat flour. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Savitri Mahadan from Florida. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. After mixing the flour with the other ingredients, I will add 100 milliliters of milk and again mix until our dough reaches a homogeneous consistency. Let's add a tablespoon of baking powder. Guys, make this recipe at home and then come back here to tell me what you think. I'm sure your whole family will love this recipe. Let's add the bananas we cut earlier. Guys, this recipe for bananas is so easy to do that I have no doubt that will go into your routine. In a pan, I will add a little oil. It does not need to be too much, just enough to cover our recipe. With the help of two spoons, I will add small portions of the mixture that we prepared previously to the pan. This way, I'm doing it. Then with the help of two forks, I will turn our recipe to fry equally on both sides. My friends even asked me to teach this recipe to them so tasty that it gets after ready. When it reaches this point, with the help of a spatula, I will remove it from the pan. Then in a container, we will add a little sugar. Now let's wrap our recipe with sugar. I will do this using my hands to move our dumplings inside the container, this way I'm sure there will be no sugar-free spaces. Personally using a few everyday ingredients, we managed to make an extremely easy and delicious banana recipe. Best of all it is that it is very versatile, we can eat in the afternoon or as a snack in the middle of the night. And our recipe was already ready, look how delicious it was. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I'll see you in the next video, bye.